Hey guys, uh, so today I want to go in a, in kind of a uh, establish a baseline for you guys for my fitness journey. I had mentioned that in a couple of videos since I first started my channel. Uh, uh, today I did an in-body in scan um, and I came in at 5 feet 6 inches. Um, I'm 26 years of age um, and weighed in at a total of 300.4 pounds. This first section I'm going to talk about is the body composition analysis. Um, the first two subcategories I'm going to be talking about is the intracellular water weight and extracellular water weight. Uh, the person I was working with uh, was describing how the intracellular is inside the cells and extracellular water is outside the cells. So for the intracellular water weight, uh, in terms of, this is all going to be in pounds. So for intracellular water, I, I have 77.2 pounds. Uh, and extracellular water was 45.6 pounds for a grand total of 120 for a total body water weight of 122.8 pounds my dry lean mass in terms of pounds was 43 body fat mass excuse me was 134.6 pounds um for a grand total of 165.8 pounds for my lean body mass um if you combine the total body water and lean body mass um so the 122.8 and the 165.8 combine those you get 300.4 pounds so hopefully that makes sense um so my uh, so the muscle to fat analysis um is as follows weight 300.4 pounds smm sarah mike mike or skeletal muscle mass was 96.3 pounds. Body fat mass was 134.6 pounds. Uh, next, uh, next sub or category, uh, which is the uh, obese obesity analysis, is as follows: BMI, body mass index, 48.5. Uh, PBF percent body fat which is 44.8%. Next section, uh, segment, segmental, segmental lean mass. So this is just comparing like the right arm to left arm, right leg to left leg, and my trunk. Um, so in this section, you can kind of tell if someone's more dominant, left, like if they're right hand dominant or left hand dominant, right leg or left leg dominant, or one side dominant versus the other side. Um, just kind of a little side note. I was in the military and had sustained a couple injuries. Also got hurt uh, multiple times after I got out. So that'll kind of make a little more sense in terms of these numbers. For my right arm, again, this section is also in pounds. My right arm has 11.66 11 11 pounds of mass. Uh, my left arm has 11.51, so uh, it's like 0.15 pounds of difference. Just points I'm right-hand dominant, but as of a year ago, I've been kind of more ambidextrous than right-hand dominant. But overall, I'm right-side dominant. Right-hand and right-leg dominant and right-eye dominant. My trunk, so my torso, has 82.4 pounds of mass, lean mass. My right leg has... 24.23 pounds of mass. My left leg has 23.63 pounds of mass. Um, so just uh, this last section kind of uh, goes and combines all of them to make sense. So my, uh, in terms of how much weight I want to lose um, while working with my doctors and medical team and my physical therapists, they want me to lose about 100 pounds, and based off of my results, uh, the scan or it recommends I lose 105.4 pounds, which is right in alignment with what my doctors want me to lose. So my doctors want uh, want me to ideally get down to about 180, but they'll be satisfied if I can get between 200 to 225. So with that being said, I hope this gives you more of an understanding of where I'm coming from. Uh, and in the last month or so, I've tested my five rep max for bench press my five rep max for deadlift my five rep max for squat and shoulder press and 
what I'll do is in the next couple weeks, um, I'll post another video of me doing a 5 rep max plus a 1 rep max for you guys. So, but for my 5 rep max for bench press, uh, it was 5 reps of 225. Uh, 5 reps, 5 rep max for uh, deadlift was, if I recall correctly, 225 as well. Uh, for 5 rep max for shoulder press, it was 185 for squat. It was 185, if I'm not mistaken, as well. Um, again, um, this was about a month ago. I completely forgot what uh, my 5 rep max weights were. But like I said, I'll post a video with me doing that and a 1 rep max just uh, to give you guys a, another baseline of where I'm coming from. Uh, so uh, with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, please like, comment, and subscribe and share this video it helps me out a lot um and feel free to comment down below with any suggestions or any other video uh, you guys want to see thank you guys and i uh, hope you have a wonderful day